in my life <laughs> one the place is done really well okay uh, the people living here it's pretty expensive uh, it's about hundred dollars a night I can't tell you how quiet it is heaven on earth but you know the way the journey goes you don't always just stop at your first destination and it looks like that's where we'll be going so in the meantime I'm gonna eat some dinner here have a little fun and keep going on with the journey Okay. 
You made it, Beanie. Welcome to Marathon Milestones. Need I say anything about how beautiful this place is? This is by far one of the most beautiful places I've ever been to in my life. Right here, in my home, in our home, Ethiopia, Langano, here at Sabana Beach Resort. <laughs> the sun is rising because <laughs> we are rising. So grand rising, my people. Welcome to Marathon Milestones today here at Nomadius. The name I've chosen is Thaddeus. So it's, today's all about keeping it simple. In life, we need to take breaks. I've been working so hard this year. Every time a break come, uh, came up, I was always finding work. I was always finding some way to keep myself busy. And at the end of the day, for your mind, your body, your soul, and your spirit, you need to take a break. So let's pause one moment and let's just enjoy the sunrise. Sun gazing and taking off your shoes like this. Getting your feet on this earth really grounds you, allows the light to come in because light is information, light is knowledge. So sun gazing around this time is actually really healthy for you. Um, sun doesn't hurt at all at this time. The UV index is really low. You wanna make sure it's about zero to one. And you know, yesterday, I was feeling a disturbance to my health. But one thing I know, that this body was designed to be healthy and immune. So after repeating that affirm affirmation and taking care of myself, today I feel better because I knew that that too shall pass. And maybe it was a sign that I needed to take a break. And here I am now. Just look. This is what you call a blessing. So this is one of the milestones, one of the milestones along this marathon of life. And, you know, today we're just gonna be taking it step by step, figuring out where to go, allowing where the journey takes us. So yesterday, to get to this place, uh, the road was very challenging. It was very dusty. You might have, some might say we might have taken the right, the wrong road, but always on the right path. And we met this man that was willing to just stop his work as he's working on working on construction and come and show us the way to this resort. And That man really touched my heart because by the end of it, he didn't ask for anything. He came with us a long way. I was wondering how he was gonna get back and he just decided to come and help us. And he brought us to our destination. And could tell the man was thirsty, so we gave him some water. And even then he was a little sh shocked to take it. Good Hello. Much time? Mm-hmm. I said, hold on.
አቅሜን ይመቸው እናት የተሞት አይፎን ሲኖር ዝም ብለ ከረጽ ምን ብለ Look at this. This is Lake Langano. Fresh water lake here in Ethiopia. Unlike many lakes. It's very safe to swim in. It's about 46 meters deep. 18 kilometers long. 16 kilometers wide. <laughs> That's uh, my hippo, my gumare friend right there. <laughs> As you can see the way he swims. As you can see the way he swims. As you can see, I'm just having a good time. I just got in real quick. But, uh, this has got a lot of healing power in this lake. <laughs> Hey, 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 hold the camera straight, hold the camera straight. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, man, I was having a great time. <laughs> Look at the environment around us. <laughs> uh, look at the environment around us. As you can see, this place is, is uh, heaven on earth. Um, this is Sabana. Beach resort. You know, hippos are very rare here, but luckily today we found one coming out the water. I also speak hippo, you can't tell. So, although the water is brown, you might not think it's safe. It's actually brown because it's very mineral, mineral rich, uh, and extremely fresh. I can say with my own, my own feeling, my own eyes, my own hands, my own feet. As you get in, so. water you know is brown and to keep you know too without understanding you might think it's not safe to swim but let me tell you it's safe to swim and I feel healed already and this is the beauty of Ethiopia you don't get to see things like this only here to promote this earth the beautiful nature that we're we're blessed and we're given every day and we may overlook so 
you gotta come check this place out. Lake Longano, here in RC, Ethiopia, here in Africa. You gotta remove your biases. And let me tell you, I've seen plenty of places in the US, but one thing I know for sure, the most beautiful place I've ever been to, and I'll always ever be to, is Ethiopia. So, 